Uh, this is a look at this two inch, 3,500 pound rated ball for towing. It comes with the standard stuff you'd expect. It's got a big old nut and a big lock washer. When you install it, you'll want to put the nut and the lock washer underneath the tongue. So the ball goes through the tongue, then the lock washer, then the nut. And in my experience, you really, really need to crank down on these things, tighten the heck out of them. Usually what I'll do on the top is I'll put a pipe wrench up here and down below a big old wrench, long one foot at least wrench just to get a ton of torque on there. Most guys I know will also put Loctite on these, red or blue, either way, just to make sure, just to make dang sure this thing doesn't come loose. Uh, 3,500 pounds is a little bit on the light side for a two inch ball. You can see on this multi hitch ball, this two inch ball is rated to 6K, 6,000 pounds. That is because this thing is welded on. It's not bolted on. 3,500 pounds is on the lighter side with the trailer. So check it out. If you're running a 4,000 pound trailer or a 10,000 pound trailer, two inch ball, you're gonna want something a little more rugged than this. But if you're running an aluminum trailer or a light boat trailer, this thing's perfect. I've had a couple of these, have never had trouble with them. Like I've never actually seen a trailer ball fail. This has square sides so you can Get it up in close to your hitch if you need the room. Also, if you want to put a big wrench on this thing, you can when you're tightening it up. All right, that is this two inch, 3,500 pound rated ball. Obviously galvanized, clean to resist rust and corrosion.